Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can use the Notes and Highlights feature within Sora to annotate as you read. So we are in Launchpad in the Library Resources folder and we're going to open up the Sora app. You can also open up the Sora app on your phone, but by going through ClassLink it'll log you in automatically as well. So once you're in Sora, you can click on the shelf icon to see your current checkouts and we'll go ahead and open our book. So this will bring you to the page where you can start reading the book if you click in the center. That'll clear out your menu items. So if there's a passage or a sentence or even a word that you'd like to highlight or make notes with, simply hold the cursor and simply highlight that passage. You'll notice that you have options to define, highlight, or search. So in order to highlight and make a note, click on highlight. You can choose uh, one of three colors to highlight, and then you can add a note. So maybe I highlighted that uh, particular passage because it's a good example of character description. Then we'll mark done and that note is saved within Sora. And so you can keep moving through your book, reading and highlighting and making notes. You can even close out the book and come back to it later on and all of your notes will be saved as you go. So to close the book, we'll click near the bottom to open up our menu items and then close out the book. Now, if I want to see my notes and highlights later on, or if I even want to export them out of Sora, we can do that. Simply go to the home screen and scroll down and you'll see your recent notes and highlights. Simply click on the book that you want to pull your notes and highlights from. And then there's an uh, export button up at the top. Click on that. And I would recommend exporting to Google Drive. From here, you can choose the type of format. And I would recommend choosing text because that way, if you need to edit or add anything to the document later on, you can do that. It'll give you a chance to change the location within Drive. So if you have a specific folder set up that you want to add your notes to, you can do that. Simply click Save. And it's now sending those uh, notes to your Google Drive. So now if we go to our Google Drive, and we look at our recent uh, files, we'll see our Sora notes. And if we go to open with Google Docs, you'll be able to open that notes document and then be able to make edits or add uh, additional text if needed. So that's how you can use um, notes and highlights in Sora to make annotations and export them into your Google Drive.